how you are doing i trust that you are all fine and great you are welcome to another interesting youtube video also i don't know if you've seen this one or i don't know if i've posted a video this one i don't know sha but even if i have i have not welcomed you guys to a new month welcome to another new month welcome to february the month of love the month of surprises the month of plenty plenty gifts also it's the month of parara if you understand what i mean by parara please let me know in the comment section you're welcome guys thank you so much for tuning in again so from the title you can see it it is bold that two influential youtubers like two influent not just ordinary youtubers two influential youtubers they are in my dm on instagram if you want to know more or if you want to know what all of this is all about please keep watching so yeah welcome back guys like i said in the other slide i said two influential youtubers two well-known youtubers were in my dm why what happened what did i do what did they do <laughs> no, no no nothing but happened okay this is the backstory or this is the explanation or here is the detail of what actually happened that two influential youtubers were in my dm on instagram the last video i posted about how i and my husband met the story time i actually gave the day i filmed that video due to the fact that i am a mom youtuber and i don't have time whenever i shoot like that and i have the time i actually have the luxury and my yoga here is willing to cooperate i actually bulk shoot that is i shoot two or three videos all together do you understand so i'll just be left with editing and i know that editing does not really really take time the way okay yeah editing takes time but i don't need to put in much time or much effort the way i put into filming so i don't know i'll be left with editing right so that day i bought shots so i shot two videos that one you saw and the other one you were supposed to see was the one that was supposed to go up this week but unfortunately after i finished shooting <laughs> yeah baby so i shot the first one i edited it and you know i was ready to edit and after i finished shooting the first one i think it was supposed to go i shot today and i was i just planned i was going to edit the next day and upload also the next day if not day after so after all of that i was left with the after all of that I was i was done editing i was I already posted self I already posted so i don't know what happened i posted it on my insta story and on my whatsapp those of you that don't reply to my whatsapp um status i don't reply to my insta story god is looking at you yes god is looking on at that you. other video i had a raw footage back so i was just left with editing it and you know the time and everything so i don't know what actually went wrong like i said due to phone and the memory card malfunction i lost the video yes i lost the video the time the effort you know I'm, I'm not going to tell us i was sad about it i was so so sad about it i was not happy about it and in fact throughout that day i was down it happened in the night i was down and my husband did all he could to help me recover the video you know to help me see how we can do it on the laptop how we can help me recover guys i'm not a i'm not a tech person <laughs> apart from all this filming and editing by myself anything that has to do with laptop or anything that has to do with um setting things up that has to do with all these gadgets and like how does my husband even say you're not you're not tech you're not tech something yeah. I not take something sharp. What I'm just trying to say is that I'm not I'm not a tech person. I don't know apart from my phone. I don't know anything about maybe laptop or doing blah blah blah. And if you see me doing all those things, <laughs> the secret behind it is my husband because it's the one that it takes his time to teach me. So sharp. Back to the story. I lost the video, so my husband tried all his best possible to help recover, but all ended up futile. So you know we have to my pictures. Pictures were not even the issue, but the video bar, that I put in efforts to shoot 
was my own concern so we didn't we couldn't get it and you know that went like that so i just put it on my whatsapp status that night and i think yeah on my insta story that night in case you don't know i am on instagram or in case you are not following me on instagram it is ifeolua williams underscore go to your instagram pause this video eh pause it go to your instagram go and type it and follow me okay thanks so I posted it on my Insta story and the way I do, the way I do as an upcoming YouTuber, the way I do, I whenever I post anything on my Insta story or whenever I upload something on Instagram, I post well-known or influential YouTubers, the one I follow, like Baby Bad Moss, Honoria Shaw, you know, Tony Lopez Solutions, who else I follow, Nello KK, Adese Space, Tony Godwin, there's a whole lot of them. I tag these people, Lydia Stanley, Non So Mokwa, you know, all these people, go and check them out, guys. They create good content. So, I was saying, I, I said, mm. so I posted this on my Insta story and I tagged YouTubers. Yeah, I tagged digital creators, digital content creators. I tagged them and I think the next day yeah I, I like i said i posted it in the night so the next day i just went to my instagram as usual you know i just the whole thing just happened that night and i just viewed my mind that max last last i'm going to shoot another video last last um, we moved jerry like i said in that my post we moved so the next day i just got a dm a reply to the insta story yeah a reply to it in my dm from two influential youtubers and that is baby badness her name is baby but the way it is on youtube it is baby badness and olori esha baby badness is a youtuber based in lagos nigeria also a mom youtuber for that matter also olori esha is based in houston texas and she is a mom youtuber also so i got responses from these two influential YouTubers. And guys, you see me mentioning two influential YouTubers. That's because it actually means a lot to me. That's because I am happy because people actually view my Insta story or people actually view whatever I post. Not that people, yeah, fine. I'm, I appreciate it that people that are not yet influential view my Insta story and all. But I'm also happy that all these influential YouTubers that i tag i don't just tag them they don't just view that who is this one disturbing my i know there are some people like that they don't just view it like who is this one disturbing my 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 instagram and be who is this one disturbing my phone or something but these two these two women replied it you know they replied this insta story guys your baby girl is blowing <laughs> so they replied it and baby said she said no both of them actually gave me sweet words like they actually encouraged me i can't really remember how they said it in their words but they encouraged me okay i think i can remember only just said oh i'm so sorry about it um continue to do well or something something she said she's sorry about the whole thing and you know she encouraged me she advised me and baby said the same thing that oh my dear i'm so sorry about that blah 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 even um they influential youtubers they as influential youtubers it happens to them that is they lose footages you understand they finish shooting at times like this and they can't even find the footage again due to something something that happened so yeah i actually thanked them i was happy i told them i actually let them know that i was so happy that they replied my insta so, story yeah thank you for coming with me on that small gist but it actually means a lot to me those two influential youtubers viewed my insta story and said something sweet so i don't know if you are watching baby bad Boss and honoria show i want to thank you guys for what you actually did in case you don't know yeah you feel it's just you picking up your phone and just replying and just typing words <laughs> so it's just to type but no it actually means a lot to me it is a lot to me and i really really appreciate it thank you so much so to the second part of this video i'm going to be giving some updates some things that have been happening in the past few weeks to this young man 
<laughs> yeah. So this young one and me. So I'm going to give you a few updates. If you're interested, please keep watching. So thank you so much, guys. Please forgive whatever you are seeing. You know what it is. So like I said, in I'm going to be giving the details of what has been going on with Asha and I in Asha is my son in case you don't know I'm a mom in case you're seeing me for the first time I'm a mom and Asha is my son is my first son happy things actually happy activities happy milestones I would say that has been going on with Asha and I Asha will be six months in this month you understand you understand it'll be six months in this month of february february the 19th yeah he's sharing the date with his dad his dad my husband would also be having his birthday february 19th yay <laughs> i don't know why i'm happy it's not my birthday but i'm happy guys don't mind me so yeah i shall be six months this month so in the past few weeks, or let me say since Asha clocked five months, my baby has been rolling. As in, I mean, he has been tumbling. Do you understand? He has been rolling and rolling. When you put him on the bed, his back must anywhere actually, even on the floor, his back must not touch the floor. As soon as his back touches the floor, he rolls. Do you understand? He rolls and, you know, my baby is all happy and smiling and, and I'm like, oh boy. This is so good. And for the past few weeks, for the past few, like I said, since it clocked five months, for the past few weeks, I've not been able to get that on camera. I've not been able to get that act on camera, that rolling. I've not been able to get it on camera. But anytime I get it on camera, I'll sure post it on my Insta story. So in case, again, for the second time, in case you're not following me on Instagram, my username is Ife Olua Williams underscore. Thank you. He has been rolling and, you know, sometimes I get scared. Putting him on the bed alone. Guys, <laughs> I'm not going to tell Izo. Yeah, fine. I feel okay at this point. I'm a little bit free. But I'm not also free. I'm free because, okay, I don't have to carry him everywhere i go i can just put him on the bed and support him with some pillows and all you know for just two minutes that i'll be away and i'm going to you know get back to him and all also i want to say i'm not free because anywhere i put him someone has to be there with him if i am not there with him then whatever i am doing i have to be done in seconds and go back to him because he can just roll over and throw the pillows away and you know god forbid my baby has been rolling and guys, his grip these days. <laughs> if Asha should grip your ear, <laughs> it should look like our African mothers, they are the one gripping your ear, they are the one warning that, oh, King Boron, oh, King Boron. <laughs> That's the way it is for me, guys. His grip is so strong. That's what I would qualify it as. It is so, so strong. So, these days, you know, since five months, my baby has been, you know, showcasing Rishi Rishi talent which I'm happy about as a mom, you know, joys of motherhood, you know, you understand. So yeah, I've been happy about all of this. Also, my baby has been screaming. Hmm. His speech is so, so, so high and, you know, I'm happy for that. You know, all of these things, I'm actually sharing them from the perspective of a joyful mom, from the perspective of a happy mom. You know, this is what I call joys of motherhood i'm happy guys i'm happy seeing my baby doing all of these things i mean the other day i was just thinking of it i was just looking at my baby like this guy that was that was in my hands you know a few months ago that was as tiny as anything now you can please judge from tiny to <laughs> from tiny to you know orobola like this <laughs> you don't know what orobola means it means big or above. <laughs> like someone that's fat, someone that is big. That's what Orobonla is. Or that, that's what Orobonla means. So, this past few weeks has been beautiful, has been eventful for us, for me, for Asha, and for his dad. Yeah, because, I mean, we're always happy. Whenever he does 
these things you know if we just look at ourselves and smile like oh my god that's a baby that's a baby we are thankful to god for all of this so i just said let me just come out and just give you a small gist you know about the update you know what has been going on with asha oh, so let's i forget guys we got asha a gift like we got him a gift i feel with this gift i'm touching it right now i feel with this gift Everything is going to be a little bit easy because all I just need to do is just put him in it and, you know, go about my chores and just look after him once in a while. He's also looking at it right now. We got him a walker, guys. I'll try and take the picture of the walker. I did a video about the about unboxing it or something but if i'm able to insert it i'll insert it but if i'm not able to i'm going to take a picture of the walker with him in it i'm going to take a picture of it and insert it somewhere you're going to see it's going to pop up sure so i put asha in his walker whenever i need to do stuff so yes guys i just decided to come out to give this update this quick and short update about what has been going on with me and Bobo, Bobo, I mean, Asha. Thank you so much, guys, for coming with me on this, my short story. Yeah. In case you are not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please, what are you waiting for? Help me now. Help me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell so as to get notified whenever I post a new video. Also, please follow me on Instagram. It is Ifeolua Williams underscore. Bye.